All right, all right, we're back for some more advanced grilling with Triple S Games. Don't worry, I'm gonna get a haircut in a couple days. So, woo! We learned last time that we turned the burners all down and that is, oh boy, okay. There we go. That's the technique. We don't wanna push these and squash the other ones. You can't really see what I'm doing. Can I let's make this bigger? There we go. I think one of these is gonna to need to have three because we have 11. Instead of a nice even number, we went with a prime. Let's start a lemon tree. Check it out, there's a little lemon right there. We're not gonna use that for this. Okay, well, I miscalculated this. We're gonna need many to have, to have three here. There we go. So, the key, remember, is have these burners down. But, if it's a little too hot, all you do is just give it a nice whack. There we go. And now the temperature is gonna be nice and low for us. Okay, while that's going, we can come over here. These are our chickens. Last time they were just running around. Now we've got them pecking down that area for some, for some going here. Going, I don't know what I'm trying to say. These are our goats. But if you have this problem, I don't know, oh, you can't see it. Oh, it's because I turned off the water. But you can see how this is all soaked and the water is like running down this. Hey, Molly, that's Molly and Billy and Minnie. And then Molly's baby is, is in there somewhere. I'll go show you guys in a little bit. But anyways, if this thing is just constantly dripping out, this is what you do to fix it. Okay, you locate your sprinkler box. You need to buy a replacement diaphragm. You open it up. You locate the zone. You have to turn off your water before you do this part. Otherwise, you'll have problems. You pull it off like that. Keep the, keep the spring, you're gonna need that. And then you pull this off like that. You see this rock right here? And right there, that's what's giving you a problem. So you could either just clean it out and put it back, or since it's gonna be like a little indentation, it may not seal as well. And these are like six bucks, so I'm just gonna replace it. All right, pull out the new one, line it up. Get the, where'd the spring go? Got the spring, put it back, have this back on. Put the lid back on, and we're done. And we did all of that while we're grilling. Multitasking. Is this leaking? Uh, yep, yep, looks like we got a little bit of leak action going on here. So, if I have to replace, replace this maybe, I don't know, just tighten it down a little bit, see how that does. There's our goats gaming the system. They already took out one of our sunflowers, but that's exactly what I want. I want the meat in the grass, not the sunflower, and I think that's what they're doing, so we're good. There's little Indy. Okay, okay, all right, oh, oh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, just, okay, we're back. We are back. Oh my gosh. Well, the burgers are done. What happened? Like that was as low as you could go. I need a new grill, because clearly there's nothing I did wrong. Actually, we'll just frame it. This was deliberate. This was intentional. Exactly what we wanted to have happen happened. We like it cooked thoroughly, so that way we don't get any diseases or anything. Oh my gosh, this smoke is... Just let me flip these. I mean, I don't know what to do. Just only do like one or two burns. Maybe I should have watched my last video before attempting this one. Oh, uh, let's get the cheese. We'll hide the burn spots with the cheese. Oh my gosh, this is just, how do I going to hold this while I'm getting this cheese on here? This is the cheese perspective. Okay, there we go. This is not working. This is riveting footage. Oh gosh, I'm going to burn my hand here. You know what? You know what I need is a tripod. Or, I have an idea. There we go. That's a tripod if I've ever seen one. I did not count these before bringing them out here, and I am going to be short. So... I don't know, we'll just, maybe, there. Call that good. Ow. Hot, hot, hot. Okay, let's, let's just, I don't know, let's try that. Let's see how that does. Okay, guys, this is little Indy. 
He was born on the 4th of July. He's pretty sweet. <laughs> Small. I guess I should have specified the 4th of July was just a few days ago. So he's only like four or five days old, I think. Oh, and then these, these are our other chickens. These are our little guys that haven't grown up yet. Knock, knock, anybody home? The chicken cow. There they are. These are gonna lay more eggs for us, but they are, we, uh, they're still growing up. They used to be little chicks. They still got like, I don't know, eight weeks to go, six weeks. All right, here we are. That's how you know they're done. All the cheese is bubbly. I don't want to melt my phone, so we'll be careful. Can you tell which two are not like the others? Oh my gosh, these are so burnt. Oh my gosh. There we go. Flawless. Another perfect cooking experience. What the? What kind of crazy sound was that? This has been Grilling with Triple S Games. We're glad you enjoyed the experience, and we hope to see you again. Remember to like and subscribe, and always stay classy.